Hey, Dad. Dad. Can I talk to you about something important? Well, in a minute, son, I think your father has finally found a wine that I can't seem to figure out. <laughs> Is it Spanish? Oh, you'll never get it. Oh, aren't you a sly fox? Ooh, tickle me all you want, honey, but you'll never figure it out. Oh, yeah? And what are you going to do to me if I can't figure it out? Oh, I don't think it'll be very hard for you to discover. Oh, yeah? With yeah. that sound? Dad, come on, this is important. Well, if it was so important, Julius, you should have taken into account our Sunday afternoon wine tastings. Oh my god, guys, you do this literally every minute of every day. The only time you take a break from drinking is when you go upstairs. We have thin walls. Julius, I'm surprised of you. We don't drink. We're wine connoisseurs strengthening our skills. You are so naive. You know, Julius, maybe you should let us finish this. Tensions seem to be very high right now. And the last thing I want to do is to aggravate each other. No. I came in here because I have something to say, so you better listen. All right. You have my full undivided attention. Jimmy, tell your son he has your full undivided attention. Fine. You have my full undivided attention. Okay, cool. Um, Dad? Dad, I think I'm straight. What did he say? Jimmy, sit down and hear him out. What makes you think you're not gay, son? Well, I've spent my whole life thinking I was gay. I, just like I was raised to believe. But the other day, my boyfriend tried to kiss me and I just couldn't do it. But then I stopped and I realized that I'm not gay. And there's nothing wrong with it and I, I like girls, and I'm straight. You straight faggot! Fuck you, 17 years wasted on this great piece of shit! I have no son! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you!